what the hell I was doing in this game. Because I have no idea. Did I? Oh, I guess I didn't make it. Mm. Todd, are you being clever with me? Can we run the game? That's better. <laughs> it's already going poorly. I love this. Get my controller up. I'm a bard, you guys. I just felt like pointing that out again. Or was that another Twitter notification? I bet it is. <laughs> oh. Delightful. All right. Now what the hell was I doing? Because I don't remember. Where am I? Where am I? What am I doing? I haven't I haven't beaten the Mirok quest line. I haven't beaten Soul Slime yet. There's a bunch of stuff out in Soul Slime I still haven't done. Arand Oh right. Is he still there? No. He's not T posing anymore. Interesting. Now there's a chance, and you have to immediately know this now that I've tweeted it out, that I'm gonna get super trolled. I'm so glad someone is sitting here recording dumb things for no reason. No one cares, dude. Alright, so there's a chance we're gonna get um, super trolled by a guy here in like 10 minutes. Or less, or more, I don't know. He may or may not show up. It's a dude I've been arguing with on Twitter because he told me to give up on art. So, you know, I take about as kindly to that as I would take to someone trying to cut my throat in my sleep. All right, Evander, let's go. Let's go fix your problems from the past or whatever. Before we enter, yeah. I must warn you about the dangers that could be lurking within. Oh yeah, another semi-Scottish NPC. This temple was raided by an orc war party. Young yeah. Skyrim, hello, bees. Just like the people of Dawnstar. Were they successful? No. Did they win? Knowing they could never defeat the orcs, the priests of Vermina released what they called the Miasma, yes. putting everyone to sleep. Oh, why is it dangerous if they're gonna be asleep? I'm concerned that when this place is unsealed, the Miasma will dissipate and they'll awaken. Both orcs and priests alike. Okay. Who is the Daedric Lord of Vermina? I mean, I know, but you guys might know. Vermina resides in a strange realm known as Quagmire, a nightmarish land where reality shifts upon itself in seemingly impossible ways. From her citadel at the center, she reaches forth to collect our memories, leaving nothing in return. Nothing. Apart from visions of horror and despair. Which is not great. What does she do? Eats them! Can say. She eats them! Perhaps she collects them for display like works of art eats in a nonsensical art gallery. Whatever the case may be, her intentions are far from benevolent. Eat. Eat the, the memories. Consume. What does it do? The asthma was created by the priests of Vermina for their rituals. It's a gas. Oh, yes, cause because you just told me that. For months or even years, the miasma was designed to slow down the aging process. But you're asleep. How do you can? How do you do a ritual while asleep? Is my question. Sadly, yes. The longer an individual is exposed, to the air, we in... the the more the mind We're in. We're in a surround mode. Not not surround mode. Extended periods of time, 
sound from every direction counts as one direction, but not the band. A few never awoke at all. I mean, yeah. All right, let's roll. We get inside, clear. Yeah, sure. Do I have a candle light up? I do not. Jetty, thank you, host. Skyrim's not responding, which is classic. Uh, let me go ahead and pop something else in my other hand. Probably, no, not Craven Edge. Um, Inferno Blade. Wait, is that Dwemer? No, okay, that's the thingy. Right, okay. Give me just a moment, and I'll have this open. Sure. Yeah, give me just a moment. I'll open this up. I'll just set it on fire. It's fine. I wish you could do that to real rock. Set it on fire and then somehow it magically becomes transparent so you can walk through it. I would go caving. Yeah. What is that? What's up? What's over there? So, oh, was I standing in front of you? Sorry. Reach the other and destroy it. Come, there's no time to lose. There's no time to lose. Yeah, alright. Oh good, I'm so glad my light's glitching out on the walls. I love this broken game. And the fact that the swords take up half my view. Can I have your stuff? <laughs> I can. Wah, wah. Activated this barrier when the miasma was released. Must have? You know full well what happened here, Irander. Possible, if that is your name. I wonder. Got Im there may be a way Poor guys, they just woke up and got immediately wrecked. Yeah. Well, I mean, they were gonna try and fuck me up, but... Which is actually kind of a shame, because they're spo they're like... Well, well, actually, I don't know how old Irander is. They could be... They're probably like a couple hundred years old, though. There's no point if that is your name, Irander. My knowledge of this temple comes from personal Why experience. keep it a secret, Irander? Or fled. Or oh, fled. Alright. I actually really like this guy. He's a good NPC. Alright, bud. I still have my key to the library. My key to the library. You're ready. Let's move on. I'm the guy who made Spore. More holes that the skull, the skull, skull of corruption. Been out of touch for so long. I fear it's gained the ability to reach out on its own. Oh. It. What it does with these memories is just conjecture. It's Our them. Duh. To this very day. Man. All right, let's go to the library. Let's all go to the library. Is this the library? No. Jeez Louise. My broken candlelight. Aha. Rando? It's just up here. It's just up here in the library. Be careful. Be We're careful. To find more of the awakening Must consume memories for power. You know, honestly, I'm mean, like if I could do that, I super would. I'd eat people's memories. Why not? It's not a human thing that I can do, though, so... Alright. Okay. Kill the whatever you scream while being impaled. Can I have your money? You didn't have any money! Damn it. I hear a bit. Hey, I'll bet squeaking. I'm amazed the NPC can actually make it over these textures. That's highly unusual. <laughs> this library used to be filled with arcane volumes. Now, almost everything's been burned. 
That's right. That's what happens. I feel like miraculously it might be. I'll go down ahead and fuck people up. Oh, sorry, Render. Totally not you I meant to hit. What am I looking for? for a book of alchemical recipes called the Dream Straw. It's just one recipe the in there, dude. There's the likeness of Vermina on the cover. It should be here somewhere. There's the likeness of Germ Vermina because we only had one model for Vermina. I'm also not your child. I can help with. But I do like he I like him so much. He's so nice to everybody. He's ever, he's always like, "Yes, my daughter." What can I be with? I make fun of him, but I really like him. Uh, what the fuck is this? What? I didn't know this was here. What? There's a chest in this room? God damn it! I never looked at the outside before. I just ran straight upstairs and took the book. What? Oh man. I wonder what's in here. We're about to find out. In a minute. Okay, close. Nope, not as close. Man four eyes and skeleton lucky, thank for the hosts. Let's see. Okay, just one second. Ooh, that was worse. Shit. Nailed it! Alright. Oh, cool, and it was totally worth it, too. I don't think I need to go down there quite yet. If you'll check the shelves around the balcony, I'll check around the lower level. Sure. Hup. Using my Todd given ability to jump. I know there's nothing on those shelves, but I would look anyway. Boink. Over th for over a thousand years, the priests of Vermina. <laughs> I can't do that. Vermina have been masters of the art of alchemy. The complexity and potency of their mixtures is nothing are nothing short of legendary. These alchemical treasures are so highly sought after that a single draught showing up in the black market can command sums in the tens of thousands of septums. Of the numerous potions that have surfaced to date, Vermina's torpor is perhaps the most impressive. A single sip of this viscous liquid places the imbiber in a state known as the Dream Strive. This condition allows the subject to experience the dreams of another as if they were actually there. The subject becomes an integral part of the dream, behaving as they, if they belong. To any other entities in this dream state, the subject will be mistaken for the dreamer. The subject will even find his mannerisms, speech patterns, and knowledge expanded appropriately. To an observer, after the subject has imbibed the potion, they will appear to vanish. As the subject traverses distance within the dream, they will also be traversing distances within the actual world. When the torpor has effect has expired, the subject will fade back into reality in the exact location projected within the dream stride. Some dream strides have transported their subjects a few feet, and some have appeared thousands of miles from their origin in a matter of minutes. It's noted that the dream stride is highly dangerous and presents the subject with numerous pitfalls. In certain dreams, subjects have been exposed to life-threatening scenarios such as sicknesses, what? Violence, and even death. I would assume that death is life-threatening. But that's just me. In most cases, the subject simply fades back to our world without harm, but in some instances, the subject never reappeared and was assumed to have expired, or the subject reappeared deceased. It's also quite possible that the subject could reappear in a precarious or hazardous location in reality, even though that location appeared safe within the dream stride. Vermina's torpor is as mysterious and elusive as the priests that created it. It's unknown whether this unique transport mechanism is a re result of the torpor itself or simply the odd machinations of Vermina, but the potential for using the dream stride to penetrate seemingly impassable obstacles certainly outweighs its mysterious nature. I mean, like, no, it doesn't, because you have no you need someone who's been there before. Liquefied magic mushrooms. Yeah, with actual magic. Rander, I found it! Rander, I found it! 
I'm over here. Yes, my daughter. Found it. Let me take a look. Ah, uh, with your mace out. There is a way past the barrier to the inner sanctum. Yeah. It involves a recipe for a I read the book. Yes. No, I, I full on read the book. Why amazing? Sadly, I have yet to see it function. Uh, as a sworn priest of Mara, the elixir won't work for me. Of course. The torpor will only work for priests of Vermina or the unaffiliated. Sounds dangerous. I, not lodge you. I read the book, though. I, swear upon Lady Mara I love him I so much. He's like, I will do my best to help you, and he before. genuinely means it. I'll believe there is a laboratory. <laughs> I believe there is a laboratory. We, we should be able to locate us. <laughs> okay. What will it You'll feel like? Them. Those around you will proceed. <sighs> I know these odd principles. There's quite a lot of debate Oops. as to whether this is really a dream. You'll be the those around. Thanks to all Yeah, how will I know when to awaken? I will watch over you as you slumber to ensure your safety. If I deduce. But I disappear. I'm uncertain what will end your dream stride. Perhaps when Vermina's curious appetite. I told you she eats them. You just carrying your mace around? Yeah, okay. Is there straight up fire in your other hand? You're just like not even carrying, you're just kinda holding it. I Wow, that was impressive. Crit. Crit again. Crit a third time, don't you, friend? Crit a fourth with that sword of yours. Um, garlic! And nightshade. I need that for a quest. And chorus eggs. Anything else in here that's useful? I wish you could loot during the dream stride, dream stride, but you super cannot. I have tried. Fortunately, this is a larder. Oh my god, I didn't see these sacks before. Yes. Give them to me. Miranda's like, what the hell are you doing? Uh, you know. Just, um... Just, just taking a look around, Miranda. Just making sure there's no... Orcs hidden nearby. They don't need this. They don't need those potatoes. I might. Hmm. Can't say anything about that, huh? Yes. Okay. I'm with you, dude. We fight I totally missed. Man, he took a long while to kill. Oh shit, there's more down there. In Belathor's voice. Oh, decapitation. Hey, ow! Miranda, did you just hit me with a fireball? Dude. Really? Come on, man. Now that they've been dealt with, we need to find the torpor. Miles K28, thank you for the host. It should be in a Zen small bottle. bottle. Very similar, similar to, to a potion. potion. I'll begin, begin searching up here. here. Yeah, alright. Up here being up there. I know where it's um it's supposed to be. So I'm gonna loot up here first. Oh, dude had nice. Jazz boy grapes. Potion. Potion. Ooh, a bitter oh a Betty. River Betty. That's good. That's good stuff. Um Ooh, Mana Marco, King of Worms? I'll take that! Skill book! Uh, oh, delightful. Ah, 
I'm a freaking over encumbered. I knew there was gonna be a problem sooner or later. What am I carrying? What am I carrying that's so heavy? It's only 548 pounds of stuff. Come on, man. Okay. Three swords and an axe. Not a whole lot. Azadol's garbage. And then nothing else. I'm wearing my power armor. A bunch of freaking potions is probably it. I don't need the cabbages. They're useless. And I knew it was the ingredients. Ugh. Okay, well, I guess I don't need that that book. I can sell them, but I don't, I don't need it. Do I have any other home decorating guides? No. What is this? Oh. Oh, yeah, someone wants to assassinate me. Yeah, another day. Let's bring this down a little closer. Ugh, here we are. Perfect. Um, I'm not going to be doing any spider pod stuff anytime soon. Those are fun, but ultimately annoying. Whose freaking flute is this? And can I get rid of it, please? Okay, so it's somewhere in my... It's the potions and the food that weigh so much. Which, in hindsight, makes sense. I don't poison anything. So I can drop all poisons. Um... Unfortunately, I think that's sneaking. Pfft. Wait, I might need those. I might need those for if I ever decide to do Thieves Guild stuff for some freaking reason with this character or Dark Brotherhood stuff. I've effectively um, made a character who can only ever join the Companions and and the, and the Mages College, and that one was on necessity. <laughs> I mean, I am the Archmage now, but on accident, really. Uh, illusion. Ugh. Resist fire. I am a dark elf. I am freaking immune to fire with my armor on and everything. Okay. Dropped a significant amount there. That's good. Stamina. Very good. I need that. Good. What if Vander just saw effectively was me walk up, pick up a book, read it, and then throw it on the floor. That still weighs something, so I'm not interested. Uh. Gauge your heart. Good. Nightshade. Ooh, fire salts. Oh, shit. I need these. Give them to me. Give them to me. Yes. <laughs> Return to Maurice. Low dust. I'll take that. Another nightshade. Very good. And the freaking I'm over covered again. If I'm over encumbered when I enter the dream stride, will I still be over encumbered in the dream stride? I think it's time to find out. The world has to know. You know? God, there's a lot of fire salts and shit. Wait, I didn't want that. Crap. Okay. Accidental Archmage. Yeah! That's- I mean, I like- they kept sending me places, and then I kept going those places, and they were like, wow, great job, we should make you even higher member of the college, and I was like, cool, great. And they kept going those places, and then eventually they were like, you know what, our Archmage is dead now, so do you want to be Archmage? And I was like, I guess. I, I don't know very much magic, but, like, if this is 
your, um, if this is your prerogative, who am I to argue? <laughs> the fact that I'm carrying around an Elder Scroll probably is not helping my case here with the, um, sheer amount of weight that I'm carrying. But, um, what am I gonna do about it, you know? Wish there was something really heavy I could drop. Like this fucking flute, but I can't get rid of it. It's a quest item. Uh, everything else is claws and gems, and those are really not. They don't weigh anything. <sighs> Keys don't weigh anything. Yeah, I'm gonna have to drop ingredients. Ah. Drop the stuff that's not worth anything. Weighs one and or weighs point three and is worth one. No. Weighs point three and is worth one. No. Don't need the garlic. Weighs point three and is worth one. Again, out of here. I don't know what this is used for or why I'm carrying them. I think I was carrying them for flavor. Not like flavor is in, oh, eat them and they taste good. Flavor is in, like, this character's a werewolf. Um, so I think that's why I had them. Shocking shots, thank you for the host. Uh, oh shit, I don't need those. I do need those. There's a quest later I need them for. Yeah, there's a quest I need them for. Um, and it is... Uh, it has to do with the Crimson Dern Root. Yeah, one lady needs them as fertilizer for the Crimson Dern Root, because, uh, Serethi, I think? Serethi? Either the farm is called Serethi Farm, or her name is Serethi. I don't remember. <laughs> um. It's one of, one of the above. Mm. Yeah, but I can cook and eat this thing. Thanks to my mod. All mushrooms are droppable. Ow! I'll just eat those. I've never eaten those before. Don't need that. It's freaking heavy. Thistle branch. I don't need that. I can get those anywhere. Literally anywhere. These I also don't- Why are they worth four? I thought they were worth two weird. Um, snowberries I can get wherever. I'll just drop them all. What is happening? Oh, I got some more interactions on Twitter. <laughs> uh, Saithcraw. Eh, it's not worth it. It's not worth anything, and I know where I can get a shit ton of it anyway. Just, all, you do, all you have to do to get Saithcraw is, to, is wander through Raven Rock once, and oh shit, that's 165 piles of salt. That's probably my problem, folks, since they're 0 .3 each. No, they're 0 .1. Okay, it did take the weight on those down. But I still just dropped 10 pounds of salt. <laughs> probably where part of the issue came from. I don't want that barnacle. Get out of here, barnacle. Anyway. Render found it. Yes, my daughter. Found it. I'm relieved you discovered a bottle intact. This place I looks so good. We should have some folks. So, I've taken us this far. I've taken us this far. Us the rest of the way. Drake. Yeah. Dawn Star's fate rests in that tiny bottle. The I guess. We wait. The more damage Vermina could be doing to those poor people. Okay. I understand your hesitation. I understand your hesitation. Let's continue. Oops. <laughs> Potions. Listen, I hoard potions, okay? Enter the dream stride for an unknown length of time. What? The orcs have breached the inner sanctum, Brother Varen. We must hold. 
We can't allow the skull to fall into their hands. Hello. But no more than a handful of us remain, brother. Ah. Uh. Then we have no choice. <laughs> One of Skyrim's four voice actors. <laughs> but brother. But brother. We have no alternative. It's the will of their leader. Nord number one. What about you, brother Casimir? Casimir. Are you prepared to serve the will of Vermina? Of course I am. Then it's decided. Brother Casimir, you must activate the barrier and release the miasma. Okay. Let nothing stop you. Brother Thor, we must remain here and guard this skull with our lives if necessary. Agreed. To the death. Then Is it talking? Oh, I can't fight. And I can't open a menu. Damn it. All I can do is move and sprint. Ah! Where do, how do I leave this room? Oh shit, there we go. High-pitched screaming as Brother Casimir sprints through the hallways past every battle. Can I take that? Nope. Up, up. Are you fist fighting him? You're bad. Oh god, now I'm getting battle music. That's terrifying. Ah! Jeez. Go to sleep. Whoa! Jesus. Hi. Oh god, everything's fuzzy. Can I... Why is it coming out of the... Oh, it's coming out of a little... Yoink. It was a fucking soul gem. What up, dude? It worked. Mara be bright. Don't do drugs, Falk! You tripped so hard, you astral projected into somebody else's memory. <laughs> it's remarkable. As if I were really there. I am a mage. Well, it was through your eyes, but... I mean... If he had drunk it, he would see his history through my eyes. And then he would teleport to another continent. We need to proceed. Indeed. My reverence for Vermina's machinations Oops. should not take precedence over our Hey, it's fine, Arander. I got you, man. You should come to the Mage's College sometime. I know you're like a divine cleric or whatever, but like it's still pretty cool. I hate um the skull of corruption because if you want to get that achievement where you um where you have all of the Daedric artifacts you either have to kill a rander for it or get every other single Daedric artifact. Because you need to get- Oh shit, I forgot y'all weren't dead. Uh, you need to get- I think it's- I think it's 15 out of 16 or 16 out of 17 or something. Holy shit! I mean a devotee resisted fire damage. I'm so glad. Uh, no, I don't want to disenchant anything. Or I don't want to put an enchantment stone thing down. I just want to disenchant. No, oh, I don't have anything I disenchant. Damn it. Never mind. Alright. Fine. Oh, shit. Oh, Miranda already got him. Thanks, dude. You're the best. Yeah, it's either Good Friend or the Doomstick and a bunch of other tedious quests. Yeah. Ugh. Like, I don't... Look, I I think I have one character who killed him. And I felt bad about it. And... And, um... I didn't even, like, use it. It, it, like, does damage or something, uh, and it charges up if you, if you... 
if you uh, steal people's dreams while they're sleeping. It's like, that's so ridiculously specific. Really? Like, it charges it up or whatever. It's, no, who cares? No one gives a fuck. I would much rather have Erander, who is a very nice person, and always calls me my daughter, because he's just a, a very friendly cleric, and I like him a lot. I mean, it's like, you could kill him right now. And I'm like, why? I don't want to. Piss off. Child's doll and a wooden sword. It's really creepy that those were in here. In this hell temple. Thanks for letting me look around, Aranda. Ooh. You don't think you've ever used any of the Daedric items you've got or ever gotten and you still haven't gotten the achievement. Yeah, I think... I don't actually know if I've gotten it. I don't think I have. I think about it. Really? Really? Alright, come here. Oh, Jesus, you scared me. <laughs> You're already dead. Huh. Weird. So are you. How'd that happen? What happened to all you people? Oh, shit. You were not dead. You resisted fire damage. <laughs> I always think that's funny. I like how he was snoozing there, just, like, peacefully. I probably shouldn't have woken him up. Whatever. Aranda, did you go through here and kill all these people? No. Aranda, did you just stab me? No, he's got a mace. He just hit me. Okay. It's fine. I'm okay. Again, I can cook that fish and eat it. Thanks to my hunting mod. Those are just fragments. I don't want those. They look cool, but can't do much with them. Aranda, please, we are going. I thought that was a spider, but it's just a plant. What? Bell, North, you're alive. No thanks to you, Casimir. He gave the miasma I'm out. I'm Aranda, priest of Mara. You're a traitor. You left us to die. How did you know? Y'all were asleep. No, I, I I was scared. I wasn't ready to sleep. Enough of your lies. I can't allow you to destroy the skull, priest of Mara. You then don't you get that no choice. choice. Alright, folks. Time to show you what I have to play with. He's got a new friend. Oh, shit. Oh, sorry, god damn it. Erander, get out of your. You live. Whatever. Die mad. Hold on, Erander, I'm gonna loot your. Fr oh, you didn't have anything on him! Okay, sorry that I stabbed you. I didn't mean to. You were in the way. It's time. Yeah! Yeah! When you stand back, I'll perform the ritual. I knew Baron had thought of you. Oh, sorry. They were my friends. Sorry! Is this punishment for my past? Is it Mara's will to I mean, you knew they were here, dude! First, you have new friends. To remove the barrier. The people of Dawnstar will be your friend now. Oh, that's open up top. Huh. He's deceiving you. Her voice is pretty though. 
When the ritual's complete, the skull will be free, and then Arinder will turn on you. Quickly, kill him now. Kill him and claim the skull for your own. Vermina commands you. Whatever. You got it, buddy. You got this, man. Woo! Yeah! Dude, the divine magic. That's a lot of divine magic you're doing. It looks really cool. It's like a Pokemon move. It looks like that one Pokemon move. You know what I'm talking about. But, like, better. You got this. Hell yeah. I should have exploded or something. Would have been cooler. You're all glowy now. Forgive me. I don't appear relieved. This temple is You're all gloomy now. You gonna be okay, buddy? In time, I believe <laughs> I will. I'd constructed a meager shrine tomorrow in the antechamber where we entered. My intention was to spend the rest of my years no, in good dawn star. the past and praying for forgiveness. But instead, I wish to offer my services to you. Oh, buddy. I don't think I've ever taken him up on this. Because I think he can die and I'm not into that. <laughs> thank you, no need to thank me. What you did was for the people of Dawnstone. I think you're wonderful, Arander. If anyone should be thanked, it should be you. Bye, buddy. Look how glowy he is. I love that. I like I like that. You know what? I'm going to use that in D&D. &D. Um, whenever my players do like a like a big divine magic or something I'll have him uh, I'll have him I'll have him still or whenever they do any any big magic I'll have him do or have like a, an after effect glow sort of deal going on with him like sparkles like that oop this way it's this way you gotta take the long way up Always baffle me that there's only one way in and one way out of most of these rooms. What if I quick save? Oh, I can't. Okay, <laughs> I physically can't open. Why? What? Hey, can I get in here? I guess not. Oh well. Alrighty. Oh, there's the shrine tomorrow. This only lasts for so long, right? Huh. Yeah, those don't last very long. <laughs> Right. Oh, it's snowy and weird and gross. Okay, well, what else am I doing? <laughs> I'm gonna check my notice real quick. Good news from my mods. <laughs> Indolent troglodyte. That is really good. What an insult. That's a good one, Echo. Damn. Well done. <laughs> Someone from 4chan. <sighs> the Fallen. No, not yet. <laughs> These get me some free buffs, so I'll go ahead and do those. Where's the closest? Echo, I'm gonna remember that one. That's a good freaking. Whoa, that's far. 
Okay, that's not the closest. Feels safe to assume that. Um, oh, one's right here. Let's see, of all the Daedric items... The Ring of Hyrcene. I'm using that all the time. Oh no! Skeevers everywhere. Oh wait, I kind of want to, um... Sell some stuff first. Yeah, actually, let's sell some- let's sell some things first. Or at least put them away. Um, I have a house in... I have a house in Riften, and I have a house in... Solstheim. And I have an iceberg! That's where my shit goes. In my iceberg. I forgot about my iceberg, which I love. Oh, Skyrim has stopped working. Well, shit. Skyrim crashed. Hold on, everybody. <laughs> I hope it auto-saved after any of the Erander stuff. It probably did. I'm gonna die if it didn't. Uh, Todd? Are you gonna run Skyrim on Steam? Todd? Ah. He's just sent an extremely confusing meme. By somebody. Baffling, really is. Skyrim's at 40%, 49%. Recovering from its crash. <laughs> I used to do that all the time. Art in motion. Wow. Art in motion. My god. You're at 74% recovered from the crash, and I'm dropping all my frames again. Really? Oh, it's because of the download. Never mind, we're fine. Okay, we should be good to go. Now that Todd's letting me play my game again. Grabbing a viewer. So yes, I I use several Daedric artifacts all the time. And the Ring of Hyrcene is definitely one of them. Of the others, um... Hmm. There's the ring. There's the skull. I don't use the skull. There's the armor from, uh... Wow, it saved on Crash. 
I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Uh, oh, no, it didn't quite save and crash. Whatever, that's fine. Um, there's the armor you get from Boethia. Really? S Skyrim? A problem has caused the program to stop working correctly. Okay, well... So we're gonna sync up again, huh? Oh, we're gonna do this again, huh? Yeah, alright. Yeah, alright. Alright, you wanna- you wanna play the game? It doesn't. Okay, so I've learned my lesson not to try and fast travel to my iceberg now, cause, uh... Apparently it won't let me. So I'll just have to fast travel- I'm gonna try fast travel anywhere else and see if- if it lets me, um, if it lets me go anywhere. If it'll freaking update, are you kidding me? Come on, dude. Okay. It got over itself there, I guess. Uh, okay, so what else have we got? Mayroon's Razor. Don't really use Mayroon's Razor that much. Um... The axe? Never used it. Kinda hate that quest. Talking dog is kinda fun, cause he's sassy. Um, otherwise, no. I, det I despise him. Uh, let's see. What do you- whatever you get from, um... Mm, what's his name? Starts with an M? Fuck, I'll just go ahead and do this. Oh, this one. It's a big old pillar. I wonder where that goes. Oh, hello. Where are these little bits? Just, they're just oversized. They're really big skeevers. But they each have a danger heart, so like... Profit! You know? Because technically they're dangerous, so they each give you a danger heart, which is baller. Uh, let's see if I can jump up this. Oh my god, I can. 13 oranges, why would you let me do this? Oh, there's the invisible wall. <laughs> Unnameable things, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Ivory, I'm glad to have you on board. That is not even anything cool, it's just a s big spire of rock. Alright, I'll just drift drop back down again. Um, alrighty. Still heading through. Oh boy, more skeevers. And I completely missed every single one of them. Oh, these ones are shielded? Mmm, big deal. You coming back, little bitch? I guess not. Alright, sure. Run off, I don't care. Everything is on fire, but I don't give a crap. I am a dark elf with a sweet helmet. So I have- if they stack, it's 90% resistance to fire. I don't give a shit. <laughs> and I can't get sick, so Periite really has nothing on me. What's up, fucks? Who's Why? What up, bitches? I don't know what I'm hitting. Where? Where? Is that all of them? I thought that there were four. Maybe there were four and I did kill them. I don't know. And I'm over encumbered. I knew I had to go to a freaking city. Damn it. Oh well. Took his willpower. Heritage shows Foos Roda! No, dude! Wait! Why am I still here? Wait, how do I get out? G guys? 
You know what? I bet it's a form of fast travel. Uh. H hello? Can I, um, do I go, do I go back? Y'all, I found a problem. It is that I am now trapped in hell. Actually, it's oblivion, but that's close enough. Yeah, this is where I spawned in. Shit. Y'all, I've... 13 oranges, I found a problem with your mod. <sighs> this isn't... This isn't Todd. Um, the mechanic is. You've never actually played Skyrim. Wow. Yeah, it's... It's honestly a pretty fun game. Maybe if I run out and then back, it'll reset the mod and then I can leave. Oh, shit. Uh... Well, fuck. It removes all locations from the map, so I can't fast travel. Um. Well. I guess we'll go back to this save. <laughs> Played like five minutes once. The cart scene was a lot, and then you got eaten by a dragon. Yeah, that's kind of how. Um, that's how. That's how Skyrim starts. Um, I guess we'll go back to the. Guess we'll go back to the outside. <laughs> um, actually, no. Hold on. This is what we'll do. Just because I'm a lazy asshole. Uh... Yeah, Riften. Why not? I, I live in Riften. Two main council commands for quick teleport. COC. White run would work. Proper telecom. I'm gonna try and teleport myself. <laughs> um... White one is a star, well Dawn Star isn't. Center on world. Oh. Oh. What? <sighs> highest world space. Highest point in Skyrim is the world space Tamriel along with most of Skyrim at the coordinates 3, negative 13. Why would I do that? I'll fall and die. Alright, I'm gonna try and CSC myself to White Run. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna work. It's probably not, because I don't think I'm on the material plane right now. Uh. Oh my god! I think it worked! Oh! What? Oh, it worked! Okay. <laughs> and I still got the trot on! Because it's instant. It's not even fast travel. It's instant. Oh my god. I'm so glad right now. I'm so happy that worked. Yes! Thank Christ. Okay. <laughs> Real glad that worked, folks. Nice! Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna try and get in there before my strength draw wears off. And it's not gonna work. And then I'm gonna have to struggle through there, and then halfway through I'm gonna remember that I can do the thing where I drop a thing and then carry it. I know myself. Hell yeah, so every time I get trapped in another dimension, I can just COC back to Whiterun. 
Good to know. I could have just fast traveled inside the city limits. I'm gonna do that now because I'm lazy. I don't even live the priest home. Why am I going to Whiterun? Because it's where I teleported. Can I? <laughs> um. I just need to sell shit. Yeah, just inside Whiterun's fine. Werewolf. That's me! Never ever get rid of the Alakir people there. They are a great vampire guard if you have Dawnguard installed. Just don't speak to them, and anytime vampires try to ins invade the village, you will, uh, you'll be, they'll, they'll kill them. Which is great. What? Durana1, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Ivy. I'm glad to have you on board. Apparently I own this house. Oh, does that mean Lydia's around here somewhere? Well, she lives in here. Lydia. No. Really? We should know about- Oh, yeah. Absolutely. I guess I live in Whiterun now. Apparently so. What time is it? 5.48 in the morning. I'll stand outside awkwardly until, um, well... No, I wanted to cook things. I can't cook things in there. I can cook them in the Bannered Bear, though. She also might be in the palace. Yes, because I never spoke to her. Because I was like, please don't talk to me. <laughs> How big is a cat in relation to a human? Um, I know exactly why you're asking. Uh, it depends on the cat. The largest cats can be about 50 pounds. No, no, 20. <laughs> 20 pounds. Your largest ordinary cats, anyway. You fantasy Twitter on your fantasy phone. So when does this thing open? Absolutely. What? Oh my god. Why? What? It, why? Did you do a bunch of characters again? Aos hates that. No, what did you- what did you- Listen, I misspoke, okay? I wasn't looking. Did you- did you put a bunch of characters? You must have put a bunch of special characters, because... Aos- He's moody. I'm carrying too much to run. Um, he is a moody asshole. He did not. That's... That's weird. What am I gonna try and sell? Every ingredient ever, I guess. Actually, he did. There! See, I thought so. If you put more than, like, three asterisks in a row, or a bunch of characters at all, he gets so mad, and he will ban you, and I don't understand why, and I can't make him stop. You had three stars. Ah, yeah, this isn't Discord. <laughs> This will not work. Nice. There we go. Yep. He hates when you do that. Arcadia, I had some things to sell. You look rather pale. Could be a taxi. Take a look. Apparently this character is minorly an alchemist for some reason, and I don't know how that happened. But, like, <laughs> that's a mistake. I have never, ever done alchemy in this freaking game. Give me the strength potions. I'm gonna need those in the future. I think that's all I need from you there. I don't need those potatoes. Listen to me saying that out loud. Y'all proud? Uh, death bell, that's good. I need death bell, nightshade, and some other deadly shit. Buy my potions, yeah. Hmm. 
You have mods installed? I definitely have mods installed. I have quite a few. <laughs> oh boy. I think there's only like two games with mods in them that I have down there. So don't worry about that. But um, I should install some mods in Dragon Age Origins. <laughs> See what happens. Let me break every game on my computer. Yeah, why not? And I think I meant to do a couple mods in No Man's Sky. But then I never got around to it because it was No Man's Sky. Alright, let's sell some of this shit. I know I'm carrying too much. Leave me alone. <sighs> Back to your OG question. How big is egg? Oh, jeez. No, egg is a <laughs> egg is a cat. Um, egg is. I think egg is an Abyssinian or an Asa cat. I'm not sure. Unnameable, I'm not sure why you know exactly how big an egg is in relation to, of all things, a human eyeball? Why? Why do you... Okay. Um... <laughs> Let's see. Um... Yeah, I think egg is an Abyssinian, but I just ask book what species or what yeah, what breed of what breed of cat egg is. You were being helpful. It doesn't explain why you know that. I don't use restoration spells. Get real. <laughs> um, water walking? Cool, but what the fuck? Defo not it. Okay. Asa cat? Like Ocelot, but Ocelot. It's a real thing, I promise. Why do I have so many bees? Where did I get these bees? Why do I have an entire pocket full of bees? Yeah, j uh, just message book and ask. Oh, and f go ahead and count yourself in for the one shot. Um, the four of you are all I really need, really need for it, so that's good. Yeah, look how many bees I've got in my pocket. I've got 23 bees! What am I doing? We can zoom in on it, if you would like. Zoom in on this bee. Get your hell memes out of my stream. Quote? Oh my god. Your shitty shitty rogue. Really? The same rogue? Absolutely, I will do that, Spinach. Hey! It's been fucking forever, baby Spinach! What is up? Oh my god. Get a get a new one. Make a new make a new friend. <sighs> also, because I'm not carrying these characters anywhere. I am no, absolutely. It is it is it is a okay for you to join. Let me drop the Discord link. Um, I mentioned it in the tabletop channel. Your cat is biting you too. Just writing some code for work. I saw you streaming. It's been so long. Hi. Yeah. Nice. Man, it's so nice to see you again. That's about it, really. I love your cat. I love everybody's cats. Yeah, no, absolutely unnameable. It is super 100% okay. That brings us to five players, which is my maximum. Um, I'm gonna say. Let's wait for 0.5 each. It's probably why I've got 20, 15 pounds of Daedra hearts. <laughs> 
I know I, I can use ten of them to do a scroll of legends, though, and I can use- I can make- uh, I can settle- I reset all my perk points with that. Wonderful. Good cat. But yeah, so now there's five of you, and that'll be quite nice. You never have enough Daedra hearts. And I just keep getting more of them. It's great! Um... I feel like I could use the frost salts for something. Or the fire salts, but I have no idea what. And I honestly don't care enough to find out. So I'll just go ahead and sell them all. Oh, my speech increased. Lovely. <laughs> Good to know. Great. Netch jelly. Oh, it was Nurnreet that she wanted. Okay, right. Yes, yes. Uh, sell all the heavy things. The pearl is not worth a lot. <laughs> I can sell the hearts of your enemies for fun and profit. You know, convenient snacks. Also true. And souls, if you have the right spell and enough gems. I don't need a spell to catch souls. No, no, no. All you need to know is the enchantment. You enchant one sword and you are golden forever. In my case, I have a couple of those swords, but I only really carry around one of them. And that would be Craven Edge. Because I figured it, uh, it's good enough. I don't need, need to, I don't need to carry around a, I mean, I can't use a, uh, uh, the big, big one anyway. Because it is too large for me. To carry around. Oh shit. I actually need to eat that one. Don't talk to me like I remember how enchantments work. <laughs> no, no, I'll show you. Don't worry. Um, why do I have that? I don't want that. Here. Look, I've got... There. This is my soul-stealing weapon. Uh, I had it on a, on a, on a two-handed sword. And then I realized that I can't use those, because I am not- I- I don't have any- You are level one. <laughs> um, because I don't have any... Uh, points in... In, uh, in two-handed. I'm just gonna eat that. Delightful. You, need a red Pardon me, but do I de take a you don't. You don't detect a case of the rattles. Actually, I'm about to go get a whole bunch more Daedra Hearts, so I'll just go ahead and sell the rest of the Daedra Hearts. I'll sell that. I'll sell everything, I don't care. Free money. It's free money! Oh, that's why I wanted to go to Riften. Because, um... Maurice is there. And with, uh, I can give Maurice my, uh, this, the, whatever she wanted. The frickin', um, Ice Wraith Teeth. Check your magic tab. She didn't say anything unless you were actually sick. No, nah, she says shit all the time. <laughs> you can get more money if you take the wheat down to one of the farms and tell them you've gathered it and they'll give you five apiece. But honestly, it's not worth the effort at this point in the game when I am level 61. <laughs> Where the effects live. Got you. Yeah, but I think we're- I think I'm good on that. I think I'll be alright. Do not think I am, uh, actually sick. I'll show you. I have a lot of active effects, just so you know. I ate a long fin. That's- that's my only negative effect right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've got, um... A ton of stuff. Half of it's from my perks. And like from... Yeah, that's a perk. Uh, that's a mod. That's a perk. That's an enchantment. That's a perk. <laughs> that's a, it's an enchantment. That's a perk. That's a, a side quest reward. This is a perk. That's a, that's a stone. It's a blessing. It's a 
Wow, what? That's cool. Enchantment, enchantment, perk, enchantment. Oh, uh, meditation. Soul slime shit. Uh, I, I guess stone flesh, which I've had on forever. <laughs> oh, wow, I only have 16 hours left on it? Wow. Huh. Um, perk and perk. No. Side quest reward. It makes me mad that you still have 2,000 gold that I can't- No, no, you only have like 500. Never mind, we're good. I need to play this game again. It's very good. Krivena, yeah, it's a critical role, uh, reference. I've consumed a bee? I didn't need a bee. I didn't need any of the bees. Any weapons I can get rid of? Yeah, I can go sell a bunch of arrows to, to not Belithor. Excuse me. Need to sell my shit. The greatest part is that I think Adrienne and her husband have different, um, different, uh, money pools. What's great is that I don't do archery. So I don't give a shit about any of this. <laughs> this was a mistake. Yes, you are going to be level one. Forget to check inside. There's five of you. You'll be fine. Welcome, the finest weapons and armor. Yep, he's got a different uh, money pool, so I can sell him everything I didn't want, <laughs> and I will not sell him Void Fang because I fucking love Void Fang. And I feel like I may as well, um... Well, how much money do I have? 44,000. What did I spend money on? Was it like 47? Hmm. Odd. Whatever, I'm gonna go ahead and furnish Bree's home. Oh, what happened here? Oh, right! The war. There was a war. Oh, a sapling, Gildergreen. I love you, little dude. Little tree. Baby tree. Little tree. Uh, let's go ahead and furnish. I gotta go talk to the steward, which is irritating, because I hate him. You could use your terrible warlock patron. Um, no, I would say not those. The only homebrew patrons I'll, I'll do is if you- oh, good. We've got foliage. Hello, Lydia. Bless you. May the what? You walk quake as you pass. So I don't own it. It just kind of let us in. It just kind of. It just kind of let us into the building, you guys. Did I somehow get the key to breathe, Tom? No. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. I don't have it. I serve Jarl Balgrub as steward. It just let me in. It just straight up just let me in. Nice and friendly. <laughs> what? Uh okay, I'm not gonna so buy the house then, because I don't want it. Huh. Oh, Mephala's blade is also one of the. <laughs> Mephala's blade is is also one of the um, Daedric artifacts, and I don't I don't use that one either because one, it's two handed, and I've never played two handed. And two, you need to betray your friends for it. Like, it thrives on you getting a companion, you becoming friendly with that companion, and then you killing your that companion with the sword to make it stronger. Like what? 
Dude, really? Come on. Get Jesus Christ. Um Way to go, Todd. Yeah, seriously. Way to go, Todd. Todd, I don't know what you're doing. He's doing his best. Is he? Yeah, he did a swear at E3. I'm proud of him for that. Damn, I was trying to get on the roof. He did a whole swear all on his own at E3. And I think that's great. Let me up, let me up, let me up. Oh shit, I actually did it. Oops, not that time. Whatever. Um, how do cat? Look at pictures of cat. They got weird legs. Alright, let's find the next altar. Oh wait, hold up. I was selling stuff to people. God damn it! I started talking, then I forgot. Homebrew patch- uh, yes. Um, I'll allow Volurith, I'll allow the Crystalline Scorpion. Um, and... There's a Kraken somewhere on the internet that's pretty good. There's two Krakens, so... Would it still let me in? Oh my god, it will. What the fuck? It's just so broken. Um, birds! There's two Krakens. One of them is one that I would, would allow, and then the other one I pulled half of Holy Rift from, so... Everything's for sale, you friend. are a sleazy motherfucker, and I hate but you. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Um... Whoa. He knows what I'm here for. Damn, dude. Alright. Jeez. Uh... What? Bell throws a right shit. Yeah, he is. Take these scrolls. I don't use scrolls. Oh, I want your food, too, while, while I'm at it. Yeah, that's good enough. Um, actually, I'll take the leeks. I can probably make soup with them. Alright. Now here's where I'll actually get my money. Oh, I gotta buy his freaking soul gems too. My bad. Yeah, one thing I like about Hearthfire, cool building houses. The thing I don't like about Hearthfire, you gotta go find bullshit ingredients like glass. It's like, really? I don't wanna- Oh, fuck you. You gotta go find glass and freaking straw or whatever. <laughs> Yeah, str straw if you want to stuff a dummy with it or like a bed. It's like, really? Dude, come on. At least I don't make you go find cloth. That would just be irritating. Any other soul gems? Yes. Alright, and then I just sell you stupid gemstones that I pick up for no reason. Not like I smith them into anything anyway. Just don't give him the, um, flawless ones. Sixteen gold, huh? Oh, I'm sorry. You can't afford it. Bellathor. What, are you gonna be a bitch about it? Uh, I think we're good on this account. No, that's a quest book. Or, it's not a quest book anymore, but... Still would prefer not to... Come back. Get rid of it. Okay. I'm gonna leave you guys standing in the square for just a minute, and I'll be right back. And take a very, very quick break. I would recommend that if anybody's been watching the stream since the start, that you would also take a quick break, stand up, get some, uh... Move around just a little bit, get your blood flowing. And I'll see you back here in a minute or two. Tiny trinkets for your good lady.
Do you want to deal with the fishing at all? I'm sure they would love to play a role in this field. Plenty of people here to be your own cat creatures of the day. We've never had any reason to deal with those caravans of theirs. Finest cuts, fresh from the wild. Alright, I am. I have returned. Your computer crash with you back. As am I! Slowly spinning. Play before what you're interested in playing. Ah! Do you know who else we have in the party so far? We have no idea. You're waffling between Dragonborn Paladin and some sort of Barbarian. Oh, that could be fun. It could be fun. That could be fun. Alright. Yourself, then. The woods are that way, outside the walls. Walk straight ahead. You can't miss them. Good luck on your hunt. Good day. I hate you. I also have a mod on that specifically prevents vendors from, or people from talking to you. <laughs> I wish I could do that in real life. Uh, okay, where are we headed next? Next shrine. Where's the next shrine? Oh, I have Arnold's willpower, right? Oh shit, did I not get it? I might not have gotten it. Nope, I did. Magic resistance, okay. Nope, wrong one. There we go. No one likes Nazim. Nobody. You took an internet quiz and you were told that this person that your neutral good human drew it. Oh, you could do that. Maybe cleric, but you'd be a bad healer. Well, you know. I just muted everyone. Absolutely. Yeah. I was fucking sick and tired. The the literally the mod maker knows what's up. The picture on it was Nazim. You don't get to the cloud district very often. You know what I'm gonna do, Nazim? I'm gonna shove my fucking fist down your throat. Ancestor Glade. Been there before, that was nice. What? No, okay. Yeah, I'll go there. In real life, we call that murder. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> I mean, okay, let me think about that level one, because let me see how many people it suggests.
Yeah, it says four or five first level characters. I think y'all will be fine. Though, um... Well, I do have to say... Um... It is kind of long. It doesn't give any directions on how to do everything either. I'm like, why the fuck? Why the fuck? Okay, here's my question. Are you all, ex is everyone experienced with D&D? &D? Because if you're all experienced with D&D, &D, we can go ahead and not do the first level one. We can run, I have seven different adventures from, from the Yawning Portal that I could run um, that go from level one to level very high. Wouldn't say you're experienced, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Level very high, yeah. You have to level fine and your deal was terrible. Oh no! That sucks. Here's what we'll do. We'll stick with the level one for for now. And if y'all like it, we'll continue onwards. And we'll do the later adventures in it as well. In both previous games, and they both died! Oh my god, I'm not gonna do that to you guys, Jesus. Absolutely not, I refuse to do that. If your DM kills your fucking character, there's something wrong with your DM. Yeah, do level one, and, uh, and if you guys like it, we will, uh, we'll continue. 